Welcome back to the channel, Sonny Squad. Welcome to the channel, how y'all doing? I'm Sonny and this is Sonny Kicks. Saying home runs, I don't do this for fun. They got Marin Judge with it, tough with it, burn it through paper as if a slug hit it. So you pay, now it's time to pay attention. And without any hesitation, you already know what y'all here for. Today I'm be showing y'all three of the best ways of lacing up your Easy 700 V3s. Without further ado, let's get into it. Now for the first lacing style, we're gonna go with the factory lace. Now as you know, once you get a pair of 700 V3s, they come with these like bungee cord laces already embedded into them. And if you don't like that, of course, then just follow the next other styles. But if you do like that, that way you can slip them off, slip them on whenever you want. Don't have to ever worry about lacing them. You can keep this as an option. So of course, this is option number one, the bungee cord. Fear no man but God and that's barely Loyal to the fame and to the money whom I married I rap like Bruce fight, it's hard to compare me I might be too nice for y'all to act scary I'm very sure I'm more than you can fathom I spit acid, all the shit that you can't imagine Pen and pad it, paper darkening from the ashes Of raw classes, class act full of madness I heard the early bird gets the word And all the feathers he can ever hurt Cheddar cheese is what I'm so now getting into the actual lacing part, this will be style number two. If you did decide to cut the bungee cord, just know that there's, I don't think there's any return from that. If there is, I'm not sure how to do it. But of course, once I cut the cord, I threw it in the trash and whatnot because I will never use it again. And that's how we get into lacing style number two, which is the loose tie. And this is most likely the one that I will always go with whenever I wear these. But yeah, this is the final product and how it'll look. So let's get into it. And now because this is my first time ever owning this model, I decided to show y'all how to lace these up from the ground up. And of course, because I cut the laces, I gotta show y'all exactly how I relace them up. So what you're gonna do is take the lace and put it under, over. That's how I like to lace all of my shoes actually. Just slide it through, if you can get it through. All right. Want to make sure that they're even out. Once again, we're going under over. Same thing to the other side. All right, and once they're evened out, continue going up all the way through every lace loop under over. like doing that because like I said this is the loose tie so we're gonna take it out of the top hole so that way you want to make sure that you have one space open up here you're not gonna use that at all and you're gonna loosen the shoe up a little bit all right and once the laces are fairly loose once again make sure that your laces are even and one movement on one lace can automatically mess up the other laces when i go to tie it i don't want to take any more string from this so what i'll do is i'll make these ones tighter that way it holds that down so it won't move when i go to tie the shoe and then proceed to tying them And once you got it done, you're just gonna go through and mess with the rest of the laces. And now once again, if you don't like, if you don't want it to be done this way, you can lace it all the way up to the top. But in my opinion, this way looks a lot better, a lot more clean, and I like my shoes loose, so this is just the best of both worlds. So option number one, the loose tie.
and everything that we just did in the previous lacing style we're going to keep the exact same because we're going to do the exact same thing but instead of tying it we're going to put it in a knot and honestly you're going to want to make your laces a bit longer or well, it also depends on how big you want the knot to be and i will show you two options in the on feet portion of this I will have a big loop and a small loop so that way you can see which one you like better. So what you're going to do is you're going to take one finger, bring it down to the base, do a 360, make sure that it's fairly tight. And then you're going to take both laces. I hope you're still holding them. Bring it to the middle as such. Remove your finger, put both laces together right in this spot where you're holding it, through the hole. Then once they're through, just start to tighten it up. That's how I like to tighten it up. All right. Then once you have your knot, you're just gonna loosen up the rest of the shoe. That way it gets that nice clean look. And yeah, that'll be it. That's lacing style number three, the dead stock knot. <clears throat> Hello, it's me, I'm the local to Dawn. Giving you bars and you ain't getting bong. Locked in a cell in your mind. I've been here for some time, man. It's crazy, we don't get along. I see the way you be plying this shit. It's swallowing your eyes when you pocket the grip. One thing that I know you best running that store, you take everything green and you pop them in dip. You say you're the truth, you're an opportunist. If you think you can, then you gotta do it. Pull up on the brakes and the rocket through it. At the end of the day, this is riding music. I'm the man, not your man, baby. Don't confuse it. And I don't give a damn about a humble movement. I'm just talking my shit, cause I'm going through it. I don't bug, I don't hear, I'm a fucking loser. Ask if I sign, I'ma tell them like 10 million. If not, don't ask me again. I never charge for a verse, but it costs for a hearse, so I might as well profit the pit. You stuck in a cycle again. Thank you, everybody.